hello beautiful people welcome back to the channel don't forget to click on the subscribe button to subscribe and also stay tuned for more entertainment videos well a lot has been happening between the nollywood actress yabojo and the former governor of ikita state's brother isaac fireshi well a lot has been happening a lot of disagreement has been happening exchange of words between isaac fireshi and yabojo on social media well it all started just after isaac fireshi took to his instagram to post a video of the 7,000 pepper soup he got from Yabojo's restaurant. He talked about how he was served three bones instead of meat and he said that this is unfair. He had to call out the Nollywood actress on his social media page because he said he complained and in return of his complaint he received much insult from the Nollywood actress Yabojo. As the fire she said he has been patronizing Yabojo's restaurant for over a year. He even claimed that immediately he saw that he was served three bones instead of meat for something he bought for 7,000 era. He reached out to his cousin, Tony Lawani, to talk to a friend, Yabojo, that the service of a restaurant is now getting poor. Said just after he reached out to Yabojo to complain, Yabojo abused him in return in the process. He said in his words, I brought 7k pepper soup from Yabojo's restaurant in Lekki Phase 1. And they gave me three bones and I complained. Yabo just started abusing me. She called to abuse me. She said I am looking for cheap popularity. She said if that wasn't my aim, why would I do that? Because I did a video and sent it to my cousin Twain Lawani to advise her friend that the service is going down. I've been buying food from Yabo for one year and I have all my receipts here. Yabo called me and started saying all things to me. She said I am poor. That's why I'm asking for the second round. And then she hung up on me. This is paper soup of 7,000. Can anyone buy this? It's all bone and this is not nice. So just after Isaac Fire, she called out the Nollywood actress Yabo Ju over the insult he received in return after he complained about the low service he was rendered. Just after... He called out the Nollywood actress, Yabo Ju, had now addressed this issue in a video she shared on her Instagram page. Well, Yabo Ju has said her own side of the story. She gave her accounts of how the incident all happened. Yabo said at first she was not angry about Isaac's complaint over the poor service that he was rendered. She said she even reached out to the manager of her restaurant immediately to apologize to Isaac Fireshe and also to ask Isaac Fireshe to either request anything he wants as compensation for the pepper soup that was sold to him or he should forward his account number for a refund. The Nollywood actress talked about how Isaac even demanded a fish pepper soup which she asked her manager to prepare for Isaac Fireshe. She said that she however got angry when she noticed and she realized that Isaac Fireshe already did a video of the pepper soup and he had shared the video of the incident on WhatsApp. She said that was what got her angry because she feels like Isaac Fireshe is trying to sabotage her business and is trying to chase clout. The actress said she accused Isaac of trying to destroy her business and she also tackled him for demanding compensation when he already put out the video of the incident on social media. From Yabojo's side of a story, she said she felt like Isaac Farishi wanted to chase Klaus because that's what Klaus chases to. She said, how would he post the video on social media and still demand for compensation and expect her to do that? She said she can't do something like that. That the issue is something they could have settled amicably privately without bringing it on social media. But she sees it that Isaac Farishi wants to chase Klaus. That is the reason why he had to bring the whole issue on social media. And that is the reason why she insulted him for being a poor man. Yabojo talked about how she wanted to ignore the whole issue about Isaac Fire she's called out at first, but she noticed that a lot of people have been tagging her regarding the video that he shared on his social media page about her restaurant. Yabojo revealed that the reason why she cleared the issue is because of two reasons, one for her customers that patronize her and the other for her fans who feels like she needs to address it. So that's the reason why she addressed the whole issue. Guys, this has been what is going on between Yabojo and Isaac Fire. She will happen to be the ex Ekita State Governor's brother. Right now, these two are not in good terms with each other. Because Yabojo felt like Isaac does not need to publicize the whole thing that could have been settled amicably between them if he's not trying to spoil a business. Guys, what's your opinion about this? Let me know in the comment section. Thank you. Bye.